Is your life saving? Yes. No, no, hopefully. There's no hopefully about it. Christ is your only life saving. The only way off of this earth is with Jesus Christ. You take your last breath. When you take your last breath, those demons going to jack up and ask scratch up on you, boy, take you straight to hell. What are you going to say when you die and you're on your way to hell? What are you going to say? Hell, Mary, full of rest, Lord, is with thee. Yeah, right, Plus right, yeah, right, right, right. Yeah, right, okay. And your, and your priest, I tell you that prayer, I'll be right there next to you. Are you married? I'm 44 years. Married for 44 years? Yes, sir. Are you married? Any other questions? Not yet. So let me ask this. Yeah. So let me ask this. You're a Catholic Catholicism. Yes, sir. What has it done to you? What has it done? What has it done to you for your soul? What has it done? We learned to I'm asking, when I die, but you know, I'm, I'm asking him. What has it done to your soul? Is there something to believe in? Oh it's just something you believe in. Something like same You believe thing. in your car too, but that's not going to get you to heaven. I believe in my car. Sure, you believe it's going to get you from one place to another place. I don't know. What are you talking about? All right. right. How'd you get here? Train. All right. Uber. No. How'd you get from point A to point B? You never rode in the car at all. Train. All right. So you believe that train was going to take you from point A to point B? And it did. Okay. But you all hope in Christ. Laugh. Go ahead and laugh. But your hope in Christ, your hope in the Catholic Church is two different things. You placing your faith in the, in the Catholic Church. So you started a new religion? Or what? No. I believe in Jesus Christ. 
and no, Christ only. No, you don't. What? You believe that he existed. You don't believe him enough. Well, why do you believe in purgatory? Because it, it's a it's, it's man-made man religion. That's why you believe in it. Because a man taught you that and brought you up in that school to take that. There's a lie straight from the pits of hell. So when I die... You might die tonight. And the gospel is well, Jesus is supposed to forgive me. He'll forgive you only if you're supposed to go and return your sins. You can't expect Jesus yeah. to supposed to be, expect yeah, Jesus to forgive you if you don't expect to go in and ask God for forgiveness. You do. Yeah. With the drink in your hand. Yeah, he'll forgive me for this. Oh, okay, put it down then. Ask him to forgive me, draw it down. Draw it out. No, 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 draw it out. Empty it. Empty it. Come out. But he's not dead. Empty it. You say that. He can't forgive me. He is. That's right. You know what, buddy? Yeah, come on. Chug, chug, chug. Good night. He's going to forgive me? Yeah, come on, fool now. The Bible says you must repent of your sins. If you do not repent of your sins, you'll wind up like the Catholic boy here. Think he's on the way to purgatory. Only in the flames of hell. Crying out to God for water. Crying out for water. Thinking he was going to purgatory, but he went to hell instead. And then he looks to the right and to the left and he sees the priest. And all the fathers, they call Father. The Bible says, call no man on earth Father. But there's only one Father, and that's God, the Father of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Aren't tattoos a sin? And I'll God made you, you a certain way. We're talking Aren't about you? the salvation of Christ, and that only. Stupid mistake. Stupid mistake? Stupid mistake right here. This whole night. Well, guess what, though? This man asked God to forgive him. He never got no more. Wait, wait. He never got no more tattoos. Okay, wait a minute. Lock. I got him. I'll ask God to forgive me. Hypocrite. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Yeah, hypocrite. Hypocrite. Hypocrite, that's right. I got it before I got born again. But since I got born again, I asked God to forgive me. He don't see those tattoos, but you do. You do, he don't. But if I get one die, he sees them all over again. So I'm no hypocrite. I am born again. By the blood of Christ Jesus. Washed and cleansed by Christ Jesus. If I get baptized by you or something, I'm going to get baptized me. Back to Christ into your heart. Repent of your sin. Throw your alcohol away. Quit your cursing. Quit all your sinful lifestyle. Get baptized and walk away from the Catholic Church. All right, until I die, I'm going to live it up. Yeah, well, okay, you may die tonight, so you better live it up right now, buddy. You may die tonight. Yes, sir. Why do you feel that the end is near? Why do you feel what? Why do you feel that the end is look near? Around. Just look at the I know, I know, I know. Look at the hatred. Look at the people mocking God. Look at the corrupt minds, the wars. Look at people mocking God. Yeah. People fighting to keep abortion and kill babies. Right. Anything about the life. Flood. Yeah. Floods. That's right. Volcanoes. Sorrowful times, hatred, and the homosexuality. Homosexuality. That's being promoted. Down the street. That's being promoted. Homosexual people going to watch it down the street. Transvestites. Can. All yeah. that. Yeah. All that. You know, that's Satan's biggest tool is sex. Yeah. That's his because biggest tool. Because once you get in that sex, you're going to get into drugs, you're going to get into music, you're going to get into alcohol. Sex is a big thing with Satan. But yes, the end. Look around you. Look how people hate Jesus. People hate Jesus. You can preach Islam. You can preach satanic stuff. You can preach Illuminati. You can preach homosexuality, bestiality, pedophilia, anything. They'll accept it. But preach Jesus Christ. And they want to take and condemn you and put you in jail. It's coming to a point in time where we're going to be getting stabbed and shot at. I have people threatening my life all the time. The end is very near. If you die tonight, seriously, friend, where would you look? Look right now, an old man, 66 years old. I was raised in these streets, New Orleans. I can look at a man that's high, Kevin. Oh, God. That's hard. Right. I don't know. I hope you're not. I'm asking you, man. Nah. If you die right now, you could. They could run up car off here with bombers, they could blow us up, shoot us. Right now, if you die. I don't think I'll go to hell, man. Why? I mean, I believe in God. Like, I, but you are, are you born again? Say it again? Are you born again? I'm not born again. again. You won't go to hell. Jesus told Nicodemus in John 3, 3, that man must be born again. He must repent of his sin. Walk with God. Please say, like, get baptized? Baptized too. You got to accept Christ. Baptized. All right, first you got to accept Christ in your heart and your Lord and Savior. Repent of your sin. Tell me sorry. 
work on your life now, and get in there and get baptized, okay? Or you're gonna get baptized first, but you gotta accept Christ. You gotta walk away from the sinful life that you're living, man. There's too many fun here to go to get baptized. What? Too many fun Yeah, baptize yourself, you have to. Go on, go on your truck and baptize yourself. I didn't know you could baptize yourself. Huh? I didn't know you could baptize yourself. I'd rather you baptize yourself than have some fraud baptize you. Right. But it won't be real. So you want to pray and ask Christ in your life now? Yeah. Or you want to walk away? Nah, man. Okay. So shut eyes. All right. Repeat after me. Father, in the name of Jesus, I'm a sinner. I'm a sinner. I come to you, Lord. I come to you, Lord. I ask you to forgive me my sins. Yeah. I ask you to forgive me my sins. Your word says. Your word says that if I confess my sins to you, confess my sins to you. You're faithful. You're faithful. You cleanse me. And I trust you, Lord. I trust you, Lord. I trust your cleansing. I trust your cleansing. I thank you for Jesus. I thank you for death. Thank you for death. His resurrection. His resurrection. Come into my life. Come into my life. I'm gonna get baptized. I'm gonna get baptized. Jesus. Amen. 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 I got something for you, Lord. I got a Bible for you. And you all going it? Thank you, Jackson. Got you. Now, some of them pulled a foot one on me. <laughs> they didn't activate these things. Right. Dude, hope this one's activated. It's a ten dollar coin for McDonald's. Get you something to eat. This will feed you your, your soul. That's gonna feed your Bible. Your body. Thank you, man. Oh, no, that's a good thing you just did, bro. I know. Real good thing. Thank you, man. Lord, 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 start working in your heart. Listen to what you do. Yes, sir. I want to let you know you just made the best decision you could ever make. Amen. 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 Amen, brother. Amen. Amen. I just want to take it back. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, brother. God bless Thank you. you. Bless you. That is true what he just said, brother. That's the best decision I ever made in my life. I used to be out here smoking weed, everything else. Jesus changed. Jesus changed my life. You gonna change your heart to your friends. I ain't gonna lie. I didn't want to change my life, but like, that's my sense to you. Honestly, I don't know why it's so hard. Like, you know, it's just I'm surrounded by it and stuff. Right. Right. I see what you. I don't follow people. You know, I do my own thing. But it's still like, you know. Yeah, it's like, hard. It's I'm not stupid, I'm wise. And I, I believe in God. I know there's a guy. But like, sometimes I be asking for signs, and I feel like he don't be giving me nothing. But like, like, when I was about 14, 15, I used to even blame him for my life problems. We all did. Yeah, yeah. We all did. Just to give blame somebody, like, you know? Right. I see what you just did, that prayer you just did. Yeah. You accepted Jesus. So now, every day, every day, you start reading the Bible. You gotta read the whole Bible in one day. Devote time yeah. to read some here, read some there. And the more you start putting the word of God in your life, yeah. the more you're going to start seeing where your life is not aligned according to God's word. And let Jesus convict your heart. Let the Holy Spirit move within you that's going to tell you, hey man, you should be doing that. You should be going there. Listen to it, and you will get to the signs. And I pray, man. You're going to be in my prayer, man. With the prayer you I love you, man. Yes. We love you. We out here for people like you. Yeah, I said we out here preaching hey, We love you, man. Yeah. yeah, you'd be surprised. Yeah. You'd be surprised. Surprise you, now. <laughs> we love you, buddy. Yeah. I don't care what color you are, who your mom is, who your daddy is. I don't care. If you got an education or a million dollars. I love you in your soul. That's right. That's right. We all, we all brought in your soul. Heart. Right. And if you punch me and hit me, I'll still love you, man. Right. I want you to go to heaven, man. I want you to be my neighbor, man. I want you to walk those streets of gold. Straight from that crystal clear water of life and flow straight from John God. You don't go to hell and burn and come to be tormented and cry for water. You're only gonna be here maybe 60, 70 years, man. Right. If that was well, Jesus is coming soon. Yes. Jesus, he may you know, Trump may blow today. And don't let your peers convince you to turn me away from Christ. Walk away from those who are supposed to be your friends. Right. If you gotta walk by yourself, you're not by yourself. That's walk right. with Christ. That's right. I'd rather walk by myself. I've been walking myself many, many years, but I walk with Christ. Then walk to hell with the whole crowd of people. That's right. Hey, that judgment! Everybody here! Christ takes his people off. Then you're going to see pandemonium. Then you're going to see terror. The trumpet's about to blow, or you may die tonight, but nevertheless, you have a divine appointment with God Almighty. And you will be judged by your mind. These young men here, markers of Christ, 
Right there is a bunch of markers. The Bible speaks about markers. But they won't mark God on Judgment Day. They won't mark God on Judgment Day. Hey, you're dying in hell if you're not born again, you old timer. It's time to walk with Christ. Give yourself to Jesus today. Right now, where you got time? Come to the old preacher. I'll pray with you. And there's markers more and more by the day, by the minute. They marked the holy man that died for them. They marked the man who's the only one who is the truth, the way, the life. They marked the man who rose from the dead. And they marked the God that they're going to stand before. Repent! 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 Cry out to God! Cry out to God and call down from heaven a baptism of your dark and stained soul. I'm just a voice crying out into the streets, to the highways and to the byways. Prepare ye the way of the Lord. Prepare ye the way of the Lord. Make your pathway straight. The first time he came, he wore a crown of thorns. But the next time he comes, he'll be wearing a crown, a gold crown, a crown of victory, a crown of holiness, a crown of righteousness, and a crown of power. Christ is our power. people where? Yeah, why do you shout they will realize that that don't go in there and pray? We pray for people all the time. I'm we pray for you you we pray four or five people people tonight so far. We pray for some people over royal and He does this to be heard by as many people as possible. We want to be heard. We want as many people as possible to be heard our message. Just like anybody else. Because what I do in Switzerland is that I change the streets. And I propose I am an ex drug dealer. Yeah, we do. You this know, we do. I am we do an ex drug dealer. Yes, you are with TR. No. Why? Well, I, I agree with you. Okay, we do the same thing, but right now we're preaching. There's different modes of evangelism. There's one at one ministry. There's street preaching. There's personal prayer, handing out Bible tracts. We do all the above. And Brother Jernell's first time preaching on Bourbon Street. Yeah. We got a Bourbon Street brother here. It's tough. How about that, man? It's tough. Okay. It's tough. They Praise the Lord. Crowd, okay. They out there, man. It's you pretty rough. See some demons come on Bourbon Street. They out here. They all out. They all demons. They out here. 
Yeah, I like that one woman said, oh, I can sit in the morning and get your grace at night, and I can sit at night and get my grace in the morning. Right. Okay, just so, so you can just sit every day, all day long, because you've got the grace. Right. It's okay. Shout out works for you on Judgment Day, man. That's right. That's a sin too. What? That's a sin with you again. What's that? How is it a sin to preach? It's, it's not a sin to preach. It's a sin to talk about somebody else because of their wrongdoings. They're not God. He cannot say well, what somebody else is well, wait, doing wait, wrong. Let me say, wait, the Bible says to preach, okay? The Bible says to preach. Wait, 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 let me, let me Not to down talk about the next person. I ain't down talking nobody. You, I just heard you. I don't you. care what you heard. I don't you care what you me. heard. I am going by 1 Corinthians 2.15. So You're going by a Bible wait, that wait. God didn't write, that oh, no. the man wrote. Inscribed by exactly. God. Inscribed by God. How so do you show know? Where the Bible's How do you know? So show anybody can Bible. write the Bible. Yeah. Show me where the Bible's wrong. The Bible's wrong in the Bible. Listen, show me where in the Bible, the Old, show me where the the Old Testament wrong. of the Bible, it says show that, the the slave, that the slave that the slave master can be Christ. his slave for You're however talking, long. Uh, your black Hebrew? Your black Hebrew? Yes. Yes, you seen that Bible? Oh, all right. So that's the real. So y'all want to come back and kill my baby. So that's the slave. So that can be. That's what the Bible says. No, I didn't say it was a real, but in the Bible, in the Bible, it says that the slave master can beat his slave as much as they want, as long as long as they don't die. That ain't real. That ain't real. Remember that. You said you're a Hebrew Israelite, right? I didn't. I didn't say I was anything. Oh, you just said. I never said you was. No, that's what you said. I never said. That's what he said. That's what he said. Yeah. That's, that's what he said. Yeah. That's what he said. Yeah. That's what he, I'm not with a cult. Well, that, I'm not denominational. Yeah. I'm not okay. with anything. You get what I'm saying? I believe in the power. Power. I believe in the higher power. Who's the higher power? You can't tell me. I can't tell you. I pray to somebody and they listen to. I pray to who? Who you pray to? Who you pray to? Who you pray to? I pray to God. Who God? Who is God? The God that I pray to. Which God is that? You tell me who he is. It's only one. Well, who is he? Who is he? Nobody knows who he is. So you pray somebody you know about. He's a spirit. It's spiritual. It's about, it's about what you go through and the things you go. How do you know he hung on the cross? Was he right there when he hung on the cross? No. You wasn't right there. That's what you believe. You can't. Tell him that on judgment day. How do you know there's going to be a judgment day? It's never supposed to be a judgment day. You were praying to you're somebody praying that to you don't even know exists either. Know exists. How? Because I believe it. Did you see him? Yes, All right. I believe it. I right. see him. I see him and his brother when? here. When? I see him and his brother here. You right. You I see him and his brother here. I see him and his brother here. It's not him. It's what he put into other people. It's still not him. You'll see him on judgment day. You'll see him on judgment day. When will that be? I'm waiting. Don't you have to wait. It's coming. It's coming. I've been waiting. Your black history is logical. Stand before him and bow and confess to Jesus Christ. And y'all die and go to hell. You will die and go to hell. The black girls are licensed. They want to kill the white people. That's right. Conversation over. Goodbye. Okay, go to so hell. now we're going to go to so hell. That means you're going to go to hell. We're going to close yourself here. That's in the Bible, too. You can't tell somebody. You can't close yourself. You're not God. You're not God. Remember that. You're not God. You can't tell somebody. You're not going to hell. You're not going to hell. We have Brother John out here. We have the we have Big Mouth here, and we have Lion Mathurin here, and we're going to close the Trumpet Truth Ministry July the 14th, Saturday night about 10:30 in New Orleans, Louisiana. As we say, New Orleans. Amen. God bless each one of y'all, and listen. Oh, I want to say one thing. Those who are sending me McDonald's tickets, before you walk out of McDonald's, make sure that they're activated. Because I'm giving out cards. I want to check these cards out for the McDonald's, and some of them aren't activated. So make sure when you give them that money. Make sure they activate. Tell them you want to make sure. They, tell them you want to see it activated before you walk out. Amen. I don't want to pass out no blank cards. All right, praise the Lord, everybody. All right, bro. Okay, I'm going, brother. You don't want to go walk with him? I don't need nobody to walk with you, bro. Uh, I'm 66 Always years old. Pleasure, How far away are you? I've been in the street 66 years. If I can't take care of myself, nobody take know, care of me. I know you're but right. But I appreciate your help. I just was worried about yeah. that guy. Look, he's still I ain't worried about him. I ain't worried about him. When I get finished with him, he won't be able to eat no hot dogs. Okay? You I, ain't, see him, no. I ain't worried about him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We'll just watch him get back yeah. to hot dog he's guy, okay? Yeah. Yeah. I hate to depart from my brother and leave him alone. Yeah. Yeah, you know, him and his one or two buddies might jump me, you know, but yeah, I'll get one. Oh, oh yeah. Okay, we'll just, we'll just hang back and see. Uh...
cry aloud, spare not. Lift up thy voice like a trumpet, and show my people their transgression and the house of Jacob their sins.